Hey. Uh, let's see, how do I introduce myself? Oh, no. Hi, my name's Kelly Field. I'm a native of Tucson, Arizona. Uh, this is my brother, Aaron. Uh, we were both born and raised here. I'm 17 years old, and my brother is 24. 24. <laughs> <laughs> yep. I, uh, I'm really interested in linguistics and language, and I saw uh, Rick Ashman's um, website on, with his uh, American English dialect map, and uh, we've had some lively family discussions about <laughs> accents and such, and uh, so I wanted to submit our accent. I noticed um, he didn't have, he, he, he did have one video from a uh, Tucson native, but it had been set to private or whatever, so it wasn't accessible on YouTube. So, uh, yeah, here's an example of a native Tucson accent. Um, so, Dad is from, uh, he was born in Kentucky, but he grew up in Flint, Michigan. And then uh, our mom is a Denver, Colorado native. Um, and we have noticed that we, us two talk differently from, especially from my dad, I've noticed, uh, yeah. like he, he doesn't say Dawn and Dawn the same way. He says Dawn, uh, which you don't, you know, I, I didn't really notice it before. But when I asked him to say it, it's like, wow, that you really do say it different. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, another strange thing that we've noticed is the difference between cure and cure. So that's one thing that um, a lot of my friends that are Tucson natives uh, have a difference between how we say it and how they say it. But other than that, I feel like we have pretty standard Tucson accents. Yeah, because yeah, you're in uh, high school drama, so when, you know, a line said, what was the... Uh, yeah, there was there was a play that we did in which uh, we needed to find a cure for a, an ailment that my character had, so I noticed that the other cast members would say it cure, and I would say it cure. And it sounded strange because it was a completely different <laughs> word. Yeah. <laughs> but you don't notice it until you say it, you know, right one right after the other, so. Yeah. Uh, okay, so let's see. He has some um, lexical sets up here that sort of demonstrate some uh, uh, interesting differences in some people. So I guess I'll just say some of these words. Um, <clears throat> In the main set, it's uh, beat, bit, bait, bet, bat, caught, caught, boat, cut, foot, boot, bite, bout, and hoit. <laughs> <laughs> would you say any of those differently? Uh, no, that's exactly how I would say them. Okay. And then the R colored set. Fear, fair, far, for, for, poor, tour, and fur. Uh, I would actually say uh, T O U R, tour. Tour? I, I say it more as one syllable. Oh, okay. Tour. Um, and then skew sets. So bath, math, goth, cloth. And. Other sets, um, had, bad, father, bother, box, box, and box. <laughs> um, and uh, the other one was, let's see, um, calm. Folk, talk. Um, 
I don't, I, I don't know. I, it feels like I say the L in those words, but, uh, I guess not. When I really lis listen to myself, <laughs> I don't hear it. So, yeah, there you go.